Hello and welcome to History Pod. On the 28th of January 1393, Charles VI of France danced in the Bal des Ordons, in which four people died after their costumes caught fire. Charles VI of France inherited the throne when he was 11 years old, but the government was dominated by his regents for a decade before he took up personal rule. The return of his father's trusted advisers brought renewed prosperity and respect for the crown, but Charles soon began experiencing extreme episodes of psychosis. In response to the king's mental illness, his doctor, Guillaume de Harsigny, stated that pleasure and forgetfulness will be better for him than anything else. In response, the court began to organise extravagant festivities that included an elaborate masquerade to celebrate the third marriage of Charles's wife, Queen Isabeau's lady-in-waiting. Tradition dictated that a woman's remarriage should be marked with a mock serenade, and on the suggestion of one of the courtiers, six nobles performed a frenzied dance while dressed as wood savages. They wore linen costumes soaked in resin or pitch and then covered with flax and frazzled hemp to give the appearance of being covered in shaggy hair. These materials were highly flammable, so guests were forbidden from carrying torches close to the dancers. Despite this decree, the king's brother, Louis of Orléans, and Philip de Bar entered the hall carrying torches after the performance had begun. The exact details of what unfolded are unclear, but it's recorded that a spark from one of these torches ignited one of the dancers, which quickly spread to the others. The king was saved by Joan, Duchess of Berry, who covered him with her skirt to shield him from the sparks, while a second dancer jumped into an open vat of wine to extinguish the flames. The remaining four dancers died horrific deaths. <laughs>